if you click on applications after log in, then click on SAR Advice. This will carry you through to the SAR Advice Meeting Program homepage. The SAR Advice Program overall will try and help you select a team of bulls, uh, identify the best meetings to maximize genetic gain in your herd. It will not match any bull that will cause any inbreeding. And then finally, once the SAR Advice Program is complete, the user has the option to send to handheld if you're using AI technician service or the selections can be printed on your breeding charts. There are two main options to run SAR advice for those of you who like to select your own bulls from catalogs or from help from your advisor or sales reps. Please go to the SAR advice manually enter bulls option and click start. Here you will be given the screen where you can enter the bulls you have chosen. As you can see, once you type in the AI code of the bull in question, you have the bull details, it's EBI, it's proof sourced, pedigree status, and risk of dairy calving. Please make note of this, as this will be important. Please make note of your herd size when it's picking a team of bulls. Typical 100 cow herd, seven bulls are required. As you can see, the risk of dairy calving is low on this particular bull and it can be selected to be used on heifers. As you can see, the bulls we were typing in are now pre-populated on the manly interval screen. I can now view my bull team and compare it to my own herd averages. Here you can analyze the strength of the bull team against your overall herd EBI, make fertility to identify any weaknesses. As you can see on the below table, I can now decide to remove a bull if I'm not happy at this stage and enter in another bull. So again, these are the bulls I've picked for my cows and these are the bulls I've picked for my heifers. Please make note of this bull team reliability to make sure it is over 90% before proceeding any further beyond this point. If you are now happy, please ne place next. As you can see, the bulls will be divided equally across the herd, but if I now wish to adjust to number of straws, I can now do so here. Please ensure you have a minimum of one straw per female. Here my bulls that we used in heifers are also identified and again I can also adjust to the core number of straws or percentage usage. I will now generate the results. The program will now complete the matings in the background. Should take a few seconds. The bull that is strongest in milk will really match the cow that's lowest in milk subindex. Fertility is the next trait it looks at, all the while avoiding inbreeding to try and identify the best mating. As you can see, now on screen are the results have been generated, and bull one is the most appropriate or best mating from the team of bulls that were selected. I can now press accept if I am happy. Before you proceed and finish out the final step to send a breeding chart or AI handheld, I can have one look at my team. As you can see, the PDF report will generate a report. 
can now analyze the strength of my bull-team weighted averages to see what type of calves will be produced from these bulls on average across my herd in 2021. As you can see, the matings here, bull one, bull two and bull three. I have three choices for each cow and my heifers are identified in the following page. You can now save and send to handheld if you're happy with those selections 